But I think that the, the, the initial highlight is deciding um, whom you're going to ask and then having them accept it. That's always a relief because uh, the process goes nowhere without um, willing participants. And I think that the, um, many of the ideas come from the students in terms of what their abilities are, what their desires are, what they are, are being creative about in terms of their, their uh, music interests. And I think that um, Dana Wilson took some of those ideas and incorporated them into the piece. He also um, asked the questions about where the strengths and the weaknesses of the group were. Mm -hmm. And we um, suggested solos for particular students and um, technical um, passages that students could master. And I think that knowing the students he was writing for helped the, the process a lot in the final product. I think that's very true. I think it always helps to know the people, even if you're writing for a soloist, just to know them and to know their personality, and so it was helpful here. At the same time, you want to write, write a piece that several ensembles hopefully will want to be involved in, so you're always walking that line. Um, the students were amazingly helpful, both in terms of just hearing them and what they could do, um, but also I, I did ask, you know, are there passages that were difficult that uh, maybe we should consider changing? And hands went up, you know, so, so I changed a couple spots that uh, I think make the piece more accessible without uh, sacrificing or, or challenging the integrity, I hope, of the piece.